Yo guys, let's take a look at some of the craziest Android launchers that you can find. So this first launcher is called AP15, and if you hate app icons, then you'll love this launcher because it turns your whole app drawer in your home screen into basically a list of all your app names. So this next launcher is called Lena Launcher, and it tries to make your home screen and launcher into a Windows-like interface. So when you open up certain apps like the browser or your files app, it will open up in its own window that you can move around. Now these windows are not resizable and they're a little hard to see because everything feels zoomed out, but still, it's still a cool concept and something to try out. Just remember that not every app is supported. So this is called Bubble Launcher and it's pretty self-explanatory what it is. However, I gotta say, I really do like the simplicity of this launcher. There's not really much you can customize, but you can move the apps around on your home screen, and it just feels very fluid scrolling back and forth. This launcher is called Peak Launcher, and essentially allows you to use your number pad on your touch screen to search for any app or any contact name on your phone. So this is really cool if you really want fast access to information and you don't like swiping through your app drawer or your home screen, you can just simply search the name of the app or the contact and it will appear right in front of you. Okay, so for those of you who really love the command line, you'll probably love this launcher. It's called TUI and basically it emulates a command line on your phone. So you can search the name of any app or contact and it will come up. But what's also cool is that you can actually give it actions and it'll perform those actions. So if I wanted to call someone, I can type in call followed by the name I want and it'll perform that action. So this launcher is not really as crazy as the other ones and it's more functional. It's called Flow Home and if you ever use HTC's blank feed, it has a very similar feel. You can have widgets on one screen and when you swipe to the right you have your app drawer. And you can also add shortcuts to your different apps you want on your home screen. And overall, it has a really nice, clean looking feel. All right, this would not be a complete list if we did not have a crazy app called Windows 10 Launcher. So this app tries to imitate the Windows 10 phone feel on your Android device. Uh, it does a really bad job at it. There's not really much you can customize. You can only change the tiles that are on the home screen, but not even the size, just the apps that they point to. Overall, not a really good launcher, but definitely crazy. So guys, if you liked this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. Tell me what was your favorite launcher below, or if you have any other crazy launchers, definitely let me know. Don't forget to go and follow me on social media. And as always, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for another galvanizing video. Thanks.